ביי ממה. שלום ריטה, and welcome to Culture Buzz. Hello, I'm very glad to be in Culture Buzz. For us it's a pleasure and an honor. Thank you for me too. <laughs> After all, one can't even try talking about Israeli culture, especially in the last 20 years, without mentioning you. Wow, thank you very much. <laughs> and it's not only about your wonderful voice, it's also about your acting, both in films and uh, on theater. Which means, Rita, that not only you are one of the most beloved and successful Israeli singers, you are also a multi-talented artist. Wow, it's too much for me. <laughs> thank you very much. Thank you, thank you. A great compliment. Thank you very much. Rita, you were born in Tehran. And you came to Israel when I was eight when years eight. old, yeah, with my family. Uh, but I remember a lot of things in Iran. I remember uh, taste, um, colors. Uh, I, I remember a lot of things. And first and foremost, you remember the language? Uh, yes, but I, you know, I. I if you ask my father if I really talk uh, Persian, he will say no. Because I, I really talk like an eight-year-old uh, child. That's what I, I have left from that. However, people who will listen to your new album will be quite convinced that you have never left. That I have never I left. I don't know because my language is a little bit, I think it's a little bit uh, maybe softer than, than Persian, real Persian people. Uh, but, uh, but I understand every word that I'm singing. I, I ask my parents over and over and over again, what is this word, that, what is this, 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 what does it mean exactly? So I, I, I got very, I, I've got even closer to the language and to the culture in this uh, year and a half of working and recording this album. And now there is the, the show which is uh, also fantastic, if I may say so. Thank you very much. And talking about your albums, you have already uh, came out with 13 albums, if I'm not wrong, which means Bar Mitzvah. Oh, really? Do you think so? I don't know. I didn't count. I Really, I didn't count. I don't know. 10 for surely. 10 for sure. And I, I don't know, I, I have to... And your first one yes. was quite a sensation. I think it broke and set a record of selling more than 150,000 copies uh, uh, for, for, for a, first, for a debut than, album. For a yeah. debut album. Since then you have broken it many times. I think uh, with Yemei Hatom, Days of Innocence, you have sold more than one quarter million albums. No, 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 it's not true. No, because <laughs> no. I've seen this plaque on ah, the wall. But it's not more Helicon. than, it's not for Yemei Atom, it's for a few records that I've done. Okay. Um, listen, in Yemei Atom, my second album, it was, in one day it became a, a gold record. Mm -hmm. So it was really amazing. Nowadays, that it's much more difficult to sell records because you know people download it and and it's it's hardly you you can sell records in less than one month. It became a gold record, so it is really amazing. It's amazing. It's a it's a, it's shocking. Yeah, all of us, even the 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 record company. Congratulations. Thank you very in, much. In and, and it's in Persian. And they buy it in Israel. So it's amazing. It's a, oh, it's a mixture and, of... And in Hebrew we say Mazal Tov. Mazal Tov. Toda Raba. Rita, when one uh, listens to you, to your singing, and to 
all the different genres that you have combined during the years from Bialik till opera singing, yeah. if I'm not wrong, uh, the Israeli Philharmonic right. acknowledged your special status in Israeli music with a concerto for Rita. Uh, yes, I, I was lucky to play with uh, Zubin Mehta and very, very great. So this is quite remarkable for a singer, being able to cover all these different genres and one is more beautiful than the other. Thank you. <laughs> how, how do you do it? Uh, uh, well, I think I, w I was lucky that people accepted all of, all of, just a minute, I think, I think I was really lucky that uh, people accepted all of my things that I really loved to do and desired to do. Uh, and I think everything is, is from one place, is from somewhere that you dream. I think uh, singing uh, opera and singing uh, rock and uh, playing and dancing, all of them, they come from the same place. So if you are really uh, very true with yourself, so uh, it, it, you know, it's only a change of the, the, the movement, but it is the same. And the uh, opera and the uh, arias, Italian arias and Carmen and all of those uh, things, I was 14 years old when I started to sing um, vocal lessons. So it's, uh, it's uh, very natural to me. Not that I wanted to be a classic singer. I think you have to live uh, differently than uh, regular life. You know, you, all, all the time to keep your voice warm and to talk like this, to not to waste your voice. There, I can't do that. I'm too wild. So, uh, but sometimes it's it's great doing that. I, I love it. Do you have a favorite when it comes to musical genres? If you could choose, if you had to choose, thank God you don't have to. But if you had to, rock, pop. Now we have the, the, the uh, world music that I'm right, singing. Right, right. <gasps> no, no, I don't know. No, no. Because when, let's say, when I sing uh, uh, O Mio Babino Caro, uh, or I sing Achnissini, uh, or I sing Shvila Brecha, or I sing Shara Barucho, whatever I s or now when I'm singing, you know, uh, in, in the show, I added uh, from the new album and I, I took all of my repertoire to this kind of music like gypsy, gypsy world music but every time I say oh this, I, this is the, the most that I love this, no, no, this, I can't say, I don't know, it's, it's great to do all of them. Watching you on stage uh, it is quite obvious how fond you are of acting. And this is the time to remind our viewers that you have in your uh, resume a few films and a few theater A very little plays. films, yeah. A ver very little. I play less, but I, I learned uh, three years in acting school. Uh, well, I did years ago uh, a film and uh, I got uh, the the best actress <laughs> and now I did a, um, a very small uh, movie uh, but it it went to you know to festivals uh, and I got in San Francisco uh, the best actor actress it's very very surprising very surprising do you miss acting? Yeah, I would like to uh, to to do some uh, movies. Yes. Uh, theater. Theater. 
they offer me all the time, but uh, uh, I, I can't do all of them. I think my my best, my greatest love is to sing. How fortunate, Will. Thank you. One last question, if yes. I may. You were kind enough to open your home to us, your home in Tel Aviv. And actually, since the last uh, year and a half, you've been busy building single-handedly a cultural bridge between the Israeli culture and the Iranian culture. I hope so. And it's interesting that we are conducting this interview one day after two Israeli films have uh, competed in the Oscars. You must have had mixed feelings. When no, you're... no, it's not. It's not mixed feelings. No, don't don't be confused. Okay. I'm I'm Israeli. Uh, I'm really Israeli. I this is my country, and here is where I live. I uh, of course I I in this record, and I was grown up in a Persian uh, uh, family, but I'm Israeli from bottom to to top. <laughs> Lucky us. Uh, and I know that you are living in about a week to the same place where Oscars, to LA, Oscars yeah. are being uh, awarded or uh, close to that. Yeah, they're, they're going to give me an Oscar. So, first of all, they should. <laughs> But even if they don't, at, le at least not this time, I can't think of a better compensation for the Israeli community there and others to see you. I will hug them and kiss them and uh, and uh, it will be great. Wonderful. Yeah. Thank you. One last question, I promise. Your album in Farsi. Are you receiving any reactions at all from Iranian people? Yes, and it's amazing. It's amazing. I get really emails from uh, from uh, Iranian Muslim, Iranian from Iran, from all over the world. First of all, Indonesia, uh, India, uh, amazing, amazing. But from Iran, this is what my heart, you know, uh, jumps because um, the, the, the connection that we can do, uh, the regular people, I think, It's, uh, it's so touching and it so give, gives us hope that uh, not everything is dependent on uh, people, you know, few people up there that they want to rule the world. And uh, I don't think this is what uh, the majority of, of, uh, of the the people, the, the regular people like us, they want. We want to live in peace, we want to live uh, with love and with as most as happiness that we can get because the world is difficult uh, anyhow. So why, why to make it much more difficult and complicated than it is, because it is for every one of us in the regular life. So, yes, whenever I get, and I get a lot, a lot of, of uh, emails from there, uh, it, it makes me happy to know that I can reach uh, to some, to some uh, um, real, relationship and real uh, bridge that maybe we can you know each of us each one of us if he makes a little step it can I, I believe that it can happen I believe so I want to believe so at least I share this belief maybe one sentence in Farsi uh, to whom to whom to do you want Anybody who might uh, uh, stumble into this interview uh, one day? Uh, one day, man, I hope that the sun is very, 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 
تو عالممون بیاد و نوروز سال نوروز پس تبریک به چی میگن تبریک به عید نوروز سال نو مبارک سال نو مبارک ریتا آی هاف نو ایدی وات یو جاست سید بات وی فاوت نوئینگ آی سی امین تو دت اند آی وانت تو تھینک یو اند ویش یو گود لک اند اول دی بیست این یور فیوچر اندیورز وی کانت ویت فور مور تھینک یو ویری مچ تھینک یو